Welcome to Straight Out of Trenton, folks. Okay, so today we are talking about the final episode of The Bachelor and what happened after the final rose. You know, sometimes I'm just kind of like, you know what? Don't talk ever again. <laughs> so first, in the episode, uh, Claire got to meet Juan Pablo's family. They were like, hey, do you really know Juan Pablo? Because he's kind of an asshole. Like, he makes, like, the mom was like, he makes me cry all the time. And Claire's like, oh my god, he makes me cry all the time. <laughs> oh my like, god. Like, that's something you want to have in common. And then the brother was like, I mean, I'm pretty sure you have a stalker in Claire. So then, Nikki goes to meet the family. She was really, like, like, cool. They were like... Juan Pablo is like a piece of shit. Like he's really not ready for this. Like, so I mean, yeah. Don't say we didn't tell you. They're basically like, you know, he was married before and it didn't work. Yeah, we don't blame her for it. <laughs> then Claire and Juan Pablo go on their little last one-on-one -on -one date. They go up in a helicopter where there are no cameras or microphones, and Claire gets out of the helicopter, like weeping and like questioning everything because apparently Juan Pablo said to her I I don't know you at all you don't me at, know me at all but I, I love, love fucking fuck you. you she invites him over that night uh, but she he was like give me a besito and she was like I don't think so uh -oh. it was great so basically they have a long talk where Juan Pablo talks in circles and says nothing <laughs> exactly She's like, okay, I'll meet you at the final yeah. rose ceremony. So Nikki goes on a final date with Juan Pablo the next day. It's like not romantic at all. Nikki's like awkwardly tall. Like you'd think she would be like short the way her head is. He comes over to her house late at night and she's like, I need him to tell me that he loves me and he cares about me and all these things that, you know, you want to hear if you're going to fucking marry someone. And then he doesn't like, and she cries. Sweet. You don't need to do that. Uh, for, then it's the final rose day, and Claire decides to talk first. And then he was like, you're really great, but <laughs> well, like, you stood yeah. up for yourself, and it's like, that's not the type of woman I'm looking for. <laughs> so then Claire is like, I can't believe you did this to me. You said you would move to Sacramento, and I was like, time out, Claire. <laughs> the minute somebody says they will move to Sacramento for you... Everything they've said is a lie. Call it off. He, then, <laughs> then he like he like tries to give her a hug goodbye, and she's like, oh. oh. All of a sudden, she got she's like, like gangster <laughs> laugh. Let me take off my shoe right now. <laughs> she's like, oh, earrings oh, off, oh, oh, bitch. Oh, I don't oh, think so. <laughs> oh, I read my dress. Sorry. <laughs> like you know, I don't want my kids having a father like you. You piece of shit. Nah, he what just it? goes, oh, Ugh. I'm glad I didn't pick that one. On but it's like planet. finally we figure out like what an asshole is. Like that's his right. been his inner monologue the entire time. All right, so then Nikki shows up on the special proposal island. Yeah, it was a snooze fest. Christine is like dying right now. She's like, you know, I really know you really well, and he's like, not no. really. And that's why like I've got a ring, but I'm not gonna use it because I don't yeah. know. He doesn't propose to Nikki, but he's like, I still want to date. Like, and she's like, okay. <laughs> oh, that's yeah. what he said. He was like, I like you a lot. It's like, well, great. What a wonderful, lukewarm sentiment for a girl who oh just said God. she's desperately in love with you. Girl, I'm right. just trying to say, like, Nikki, so you're a pediatric nurse. Like, if you're looking for a way out of Kansas City, Missouri, just Match. get a new job. Like, you don't have to go out with Juan Pablo. He's an asshole. Sugardaddy.com. Oh, yeah, I've been on that. It's no good. Christian Mingles. Oh, I've been on that. It's no good at all. He's okay. Ugh. This guy is such a fucking snack packet. Okay. What, did I, what did I even just call him? Okay. You know who he reminds me of? This massage therapist who used to try to grab my boobs all oh, the time. God. Every man on the planet, your reputation. Yeah. Like that men are... Pieces of shit that right. only want to bang. Yes. You proved it. Thank you, ABC. Thank you, ABC.